This week on Tablet It Tuesday, I'm going to explain how the Path Marks card worked during this workout Wednesday. So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to get out of full screen mode first. And then we're going to option drag date time onto our columns. And we're going to hit day. Now, as you can see, the mark is already set to a line. And all we've got is our discrete date time on our columns. Now, as you can see, it's connected that line based on the dates. So even if I add date time hours onto here, it's going to connect based on those individual days of the month. Now, if I add, hit command or control date time hours to the path, it's then going to break that down because if I show you what's happening here, if I option drag date time onto here, day, but then add date time hours and change that to discrete, what it's then doing is for each day, it's changing the it's restarting that date time field. So day one has zero to 23, whereas day two has one to 21. So it breaks that cycle, that continuous cycle of the number of hours, which is why it breaks the line when you put date time hours on there and not date day of date time. Just a quick one for me this week. See you soon.